Grammy Award winning singer and songwriter. He's also a friend of Fox 5, and now he's a published author as well. We're talking about the one and only Anthony Hamilton. He's back in town for this weekend's Summer Spirit Festival, but he's also got a new book out. It's called Cornbread, Fish, and Collard Greens. All things that I love <laughs> inside the music. And this morning, he's live in the loft to talk all about it because we don't want to struggle no more because we're cool. <laughs> we're cool. Title dropping. Woo! -hoo. You got wisdom. <laughs> I got some wisdom. <laughs> Mr. Wisdom. Hamilton, good to meet you. Good to meet you. First of all, let, let's talk about the book, the process. This is your first book. First book. First book. Uh, tell me about the title because it seems like it's simple, but I'm sure it's, it's well, a little bit more in depth than that. It's actually a song mm -hmm. from, uh, from my, my debut album, Coming From Where I'm From. It just right. symbolizes so much stability. Cornbread is pretty much stability. Right. Serenity, fish, you know, to be able to maneuver through life. And mm -hmm. college greens is the soul and the substance and right. the nurturing you get from family. What inspired you to write a book? I just wanted to extend myself to my fans in a different way. Mm -hmm. um, you get more in depth right. when you're writing a, you know, in a book. Right. As opposed to a song, you only have two verses mm -hmm. and a hook. Right. But here you got all the juicy secrets. Who all is the Charlene? Ju okay. Oh, that's in there? Who is Charlene? Yeah, yeah. yeah really? Yeah. Okay. Uh, I'm a mess, walk my shoes, amen. So those, the, all those songs have, have stories. Okay. That, that so they didn't just come out of anywhere, right? Oh nah, man, I, there's, some, there's some stories. Nah, I had to go through it to get the <laughs> <laughs> So, so that's what's inside the book. So let's talk about some the, recipes. It's a, some recipes as well. Yeah. Are you are you a cook? Yes, I am. A cook. You're a good cook. I'm a pretty good. Cook. Wow. Okay. Yeah. All right. So not only are you a, a great singer, an author, but you're a cook. What's your favorite dish that you cook? Oh my, my cabbage is incredible. Yeah, and I now I've been incorporating cabbage and greens together. I make curry corn. I make. Uh, Mean honey dill salmon, salmon spaghetti. Really? Yeah, I do more plant based now. Yeah. But, uh -huh. but when I do, I get a good dish. Okay, well, the next time you come back to the loft, we got a kitchen over there, so yeah. you need to bring some of those recipes in here and hook us up. I'll bring the we, water. So, so, <laughs> <laughs> that's my job. I'm going to bring the water. I'll bring the water. And then another question is I know we're going to get to the music. Yeah. You got to talk about your hats. That's part of your, part of your style, your yeah. distinguished style. Yeah, man. I'm, How many hats do you have? Uh, over 200. 200. Yeah, I have a lot of hats. Right in my room, too. So I got to find a place. <laughs> I have a hat line coming out. You do? Yeah, House of Fedora. Okay. And uh, I'm excited about that. All right. This year. Is that, so that's going to be how people can go to, where Where do they go to get that? You when can, it comes right up. Right now, you can go to Anthony Hamilton Official on okay. my Instagram, and I keep you updated on where we Now, is there a particular method you go to get your hats, or are you just like, I like that one, I'm just going to get it? Does it make you feel a certain way? Does it, does it grab you? You know, it's just attitude. So I have some cowboy hats, I have fedoras, I have some hats bigger than this room. <laughs> <laughs> I've seen your trucker, your trucker hats. Trucker hats when I'm driving in my truck. And I'm <laughs> so you want my toothpick. Right, I got you. Okay, so now let's talk about the music. Let's talk about the music. So you're here for the, the Summer Spirit Festival. Yes. All right, let's talk a little bit about that. Raphael Sadiq, Jenny Aiko, mm -hmm. and, uh, you know, we're going to get down. You're going to get down? Yeah. People, you're going to give them a little bit of, of old and new. And you're gonna mix it all up together? Yeah, we're gonna give a little, little, little bit of crowd singing in it as well. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> that's the best part. What's that, that? So that's the best part. What's the best part of being Anthony Hamilton when you're up there on that stage, other than the crowd doing their thing with you? Because they know all your hits. I get to feed the people. I get to, uh, I get to heal people. I get to uh, allow people to feel beautiful and, mm -hmm. and take away everything that they were stressing out about. Right. And I'm the doctor. I am the. You're Dr. Feelgood. I'm Dr. Feelgood. Yeah. <laughs> so the, the, uh, again, about the music. So compare writing in your book to writing a song, because this is a completely different process. Writing a song is, is just it just comes straight from the source. Mm -hmm. Writing a book, I had to really you have to dig deep for that. Huh? I had to not fall asleep at night <laughs> and really put that pen into the paper. So it's it's more uh, effort mm -hmm. than writing a book. Right. It's rewarding. And you actually started, we talked about this before we came on air, you actually were, you were part of a, a backup team with D'Angelo yeah, back in the background. day. Yeah, I was a background singer for D'Angelo, and uh, I've done numerous songs with lots of artists on you know, background, uh, mm -hmm. Nappy Roots. Right. So you've been around. Johnny Lane. Yeah. Yeah, you've been around. So let me ask you a question. Let's, Let's let's go through your list of some of my favorite Anthony Hamilton songs. Uh, I want you to tell me. I'm just gonna I'm gonna throw out the name of the song. And you tell me the first thing that comes to mind. Okay? How about the best of me? Feel good. Two step. Okay. All right. Struggle no more. Remember that one? Yeah. Of course you do. You wrote it. <laughs> uh, hunger pain and, and victory. 
Okay. <laughs> All right. I'm cool. Top down. <laughs> on, baby. All right. Here's a good one. Woo. A bad sister. A bad woman. <laughs> a bad <fine> thing. <laughs> I'm a mess right now. Oh, man. 4 a.m. Heartbreak up in New York City. Okay. All right. Coming from where I'm from. Once upon a time, the beginning of Anthony Hamilton's history. I mean, uh, legacy. Okay. All right. Charlene, which is in the book. Everybody says it. Charlene! <laughs> 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 Can't let go. Man. Okay, and the last one, amen. Thank you, God. <laughs> <laughs> Anthony Hamilton, ladies and gentlemen, those are all some of, some, some of oh, my favorites. I appreciate favorites. that, man. I appreciate you, yeah, appreciate your music. Thank yeah, you. that's a good list. I got them all in my playlist. Thank you, man. Playlist. Anthony Hamilton, you can catch him at the Summit Summer Spirit Festival. You can get his book. You can get your book anywhere? Amazon.com. Amazon.com. And it's available. Yes. All right, and it's available. And his hats, you can go to... Anthony Hamilton official on Instagram, and I'll be directly recording. All right. We're gonna get the hats, the music, the book, and he's gonna come back and cook for us and bring some water. I'm gonna bring the water. <laughs> Thank you, Anthony Hamilton. Appreciate you. Appreciate you. All right. Holly, over to you. I'm gonna be directing you.